How's it going everyone? It's Gonzo and today I'm going to be showing you a tutorial on how to solve this problem right here. The display driver stopped responding and has recovered. Now this happens most of the time when you're playing a game that your computer should be able to handle but for some reason it just doesn't feel like it and then the game crashes and then that error message pops up. It's actually quite a simple fix. Um, I don't know how this setting got changed for me but my computer used to run all the games perfectly. So pretty much what you want to do is you want to right click and go to NVIDIA control panel because what I think the problem is what I think the problem is, is that for some reason your computer is has the uh, integrated graphics as the preferred graphics processor. And so all your all your programs are running the integrated graphics and not your NVIDIA processor or your, you know, the actual good graphics card that you have in your... So what you want to do, you just want to go to Manage 3D Settings. You want to right click NVIDIA Control Panel. And when the NVIDIA Control Panel pops up, which is this thing right here, you want to click on Manage 3D Settings. Then you want to go to just global settings and preferred graphics processor. Just change it to high performance NVIDIA processor and you'll be good to go. Then apply. Then once it's applied, I mean I restarted my computer. I don't think you have to, but I did just, just in case. But once it's applied, you should be good to go and your game should be running back to normal. Because before that, my games were running on low and they're still lagging. But then I changed that. And now they're at Ultra again, running perfectly fine. So I think that's what the problem was. If that doesn't work, um, I don't know. But that, that, that solved the problem for me. So thank you for watching. If you like the video, like and subscribe. And I'll talk to you next time. See ya.